Hi, good morning. My name is Laura Jo, and today I want to interview Mr. Reta. Okay, uh, today I want to interview about Semarang. Let's watch. Okay, good morning, Mr. Reta. Good morning, Laura. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> okay. Uh, Today I want to ask you what's I want to know your names. Okay. okay. <laughs> your friends. Okay. My name is Laura Jo. Laura Jo. Yeah. You can call me Laura. Yeah. Oh, and she is Jessica. And she is Martha. And she is Tasje. 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 Yeah. Okay. And today I want to interview about how you see what's Okay. First question. What do you think about Semarang? Semarang is a, a city where you can find uh, industries. Okay. okay. And it's a little bit hard for me. <laughs> it's very hard. <laughs> and and uh, but because it is close to the coastal area, close to the sea, and uh, also yeah, so you can buy fish. Or I love eating fish, and also there are many uh, tourist sites. Okay. That you can see, for example, the, the uh, old buildings uh, by the Dutch. Mm -hmm. and so, yeah. Okay. So the second question is, what do you think about the food, and any there's any food that you don't like? Okay, I almost eat everything actually, so there is no favorite food. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't very picky in terms of food, yeah. Uh -huh. And then, uh, but of course, my favorite food is uh, fish. I, mm -hmm. As long as it is fish, and then I, I want seafood. Seafood, yeah, seafood. Okay. Yeah. And for the third question is. What do you think about the people in Samara? Friendly or maybe whatever? Are you from Samara? Yes. Right, so Samara, uh, girls are pretty. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, I think um, friendly. Yes. Yeah. Friendly people. Uh, so it is a big city, but it's not as big as Jakarta. Yes. Because the people are still friendly. Yes. But sometimes when you see people on Angkor, for example. Yeah. Okay. Uh, when when you sit on Angkor, for example, people are not friendly because they are tired when yeah. you go home, for example. So people don't want to talk. But basically, people are friendly. Yeah. And the fourth question is, what do you think about the culture? Yeah, it is interesting, yeah. Uh, Samarang is a combination of different cultures. We have Chinese culture. We have Japanese culture. We have also Arabic culture. Combinations of three. So, for example, one of your uh, kakak class wrote about the uh, kambang, uh, wrote about uh, a dance in Samara, and uh, in her conclusion, okay, she stated that this dance is a combination of Chinese culture. Arabian culture and Japanese culture. So that's it. That is interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, um, uh, that's a, a multiculturalism. Mm -hmm. Culturalism. Many cultures. And for the fifth question is, what do you think about the tourist destination? Yeah, there are many interesting tourist destinations, especially buildings. Uh, that you can mention the Sampo uh, uh -huh. Kota Lama, and then the. The building is a thousand dollars, and then, mm -hmm. but the issue is that these destinations are not yet well. Um, uh, what's that? Are not well uh, advertised mm -hmm. for public, so people don't really know 
but also the tourist destinations are not well maintained. Mm -hmm. Like for example, Goa Creo, yeah. I visit this place, place several times, but yeah, I mean it is not well maintained. <laughs> yes. Not well maintained. Also the facility, and so on. Thank you. Okay. Thank you for the interview. That's all. Thank you, Mr. Etan. <laughs> <laughs> Today I will interview about Semarang. The first question is, what do you think about Semarang? I think Semarang is a beautiful city, very green, and it has a shopping center which is in front of the shopping center. There are trees and also a park, a mini park, which is uh, giving uh, the citizens some first air. <coughs> the second question is, what do you think about the food? There's any food that you like? Um, I like uh, lumbia food. Uh, is from Smarang, but we uh, decide from like this wingo pepper because wingo pepper contains some coconut milk. Um, can increase my cholesterol and my blood pressure. What do you think about the people in Smarang? Uh, they are friendly, kindly, and acceptably. They want to make friends and socialize with other foreigners. What do you think about the culture? I think Smarang culture is different from Australian culture because Smarang culture uh, uses shake hands with uh, right hand and usually Australian uses left hand to receive culture so uh, this is the example of the politeness in Smarang The last, what do you think about the tourist destination? <coughs> Some tourists uh, experience Smarang is a metropolitan but religious city because uh, they respect most of Muslims in Smarang and uh, so other non-Muslims uh, they give chance to uh, celebrate before fasting day which is Tukdera Para Ngendok everywhere in Smarang Uh, I want to interview you about Smarang. Sure. Uh, first question. What do you think about Smarang? It's freaking hot. Since uh, my uh, what is it called? My hometown is located on the slope of Mount Merbabu. It is re relatively um, what is it called? Windy. Not really cold, but still, it's not as hot as Semarang. So. Smarang is just like, what is it called? A burning furnace for me. I cannot stand it. Second question is, what do you think about the food? Uh, there's any food that you don't like? The food that I don't like? Um, specifically, I guess, um, there is no food that I don't like because I am I am a hearty eater, it means I love eating, I eat a lot and so far I have no kinds of com what is it called? Um, no kinds of reaction that will give me uh, food poisoning after I eat anything food made in Semarang or originally come from Semarang so I'm fine with the food. Third question is what do you think about the people in Semarang? Surprisingly, they're just like um, modern people living in metropolitan city, which means um, people who live in metropolitan city tends to hang out a lot and tends to look for malls to chill out and kill their time, and then um, their way of having fun means.
burning money. <laughs> so to me, um, that's really not the kind of lifestyle that I would indulge myself in because I tend to value money in different way in comparison to how teenagers or youngsters or simply people in Sumatra uh, <coughs> see the money as a value. So yeah, they are very consumptive. <laughs> they are hedonistic in some kind, some ways, which is very human, and I can understand that. Um, part question is: What do you think about the concept of culture? <coughs> culture, I think, based on my observation, it's fading away. Um, not so many people are interested in. Um, in practicing the culture in whatever form it is, be it dancing or playing gamelan or um, try to sing some songs that that are usually <coughs> performed by singing, they tend to embrace the um, globalized culture that comes from US or any Western countries abroad. So yeah, the culture in Samarang doesn't really look like the culture of um, Japanese people but it's all blended, with, it's all mixed up. Sometimes I couldn't even tell whether Samarang has its original culture. And the last question is, what do you think about the tourist destination? Tourist destination, I think it needs more improvement on the infrastructure because um, the last time I visited Kota uh, Lama and the surrounding area and also in Lawang <coughs> Sewu The tourist guides are nice, I mean the way they explain everything is already good but the way they maintain the sites need to be improved like um, what is it called? Littering issues and then um, uh, what is it called? The Conservation kind of thing. Need to manage the site more, and they simply need more people who is really eager to deal with the tourism sites and also about the um, cultural heritage in material form. I think that's all I can say about it. So thank you. Hello. 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 Interview about Samarang. My name is Tashi. Uh, my name is Seth. Okay. Uh, first question is, what do you think about Samarang? Well, I think that Samarang is a nice city, very hot, with a lot of traffic jam for me. And yeah, but I like it. Nice people. Uh, yeah, it's nice. Okay. And for the second question is, what do you think about the food? Well, I think that the food is spicy, like too much spicy for me, and many times it's sweet and spicy, it's a bit weird, but no, it's okay for me. Yeah, I'm getting fine with that. <laughs> and for the third, what do you think about the people in Uh People are friendly, at least for me, always asking to take photos and making Instagram story and so on. Yeah, but it's funny. <laughs> For the fourth, what do you think about the culture? Well, for me, it's really different to be here, and there is a lot of different cultures, so it's a multicultural country. Uh, yeah, I had like a cultural shock in the beginning, but now it's everything fine. And the last question is: What do you think about the tourist destination in Europe? Well, I didn't visit much of uh, Indonesia. I think Samarang is not really a touristic city. Uh, there is not much to see in Europe. And I didn't go yet to Bali. I've been just in Kalimantan, Java. It's uh, really nice. Yeah. Um, but I can. I saw some pictures and some vlogs, and I can see that there is a lot of things to do in Indonesia and a lot of places to visit. Okay, that sounds. Thank, Thank you. you.